Uh, it's a good day to you all. I was asked if I could make a video about the new features of this uh, D30 mod. Well, uh, let's get into it. I have my gun here and uh, the two main new features I would like to discuss today is uh, what is the compass. Uh, now you have a pretty big compass. Uh, you see, and it's not only big, it can zoom and it's very precise and also you have the uh, digitally indicated on the red pointer your heading in Russian mills so it's 4103 so let's see uh, we would like to know the heading of that house we just point to it it's 4543 you see and the other is the map tools let's get into the map and if you uh, switch on the normal map tool you bring up your map tool it's basically it is an artillery spot um, artillery uh, what is it plotter and I would like you I would like to discuss how to use it well to use it you basically what you need is a is a target so let's get to our spotter and I just uh, set up a mission I spotted a I spotted a yeah they are there I spotted a mortar team you see a mortar three mortars on the side of the road and I just uh, would like to know what it is well on the map you see your position you have your compass and they are on just our side of the main road you see what this road from uh, this road from the east gets into the main road and they are on our side of that road so they are they must be they must be somewhere here let's make it a destroy sign and red okay so that's where we suppose our target is let's get back to our gun crew and uh, target them well leveling is fine because we are in a salt lake we just fix floating good and start working with the map tool well uh, before everything I strongly suggest you to draw like well uh, draw a line between the your orientation point and your gun and I will explain to you later why uh, and I also strongly suggest to limit zoom just for the sake of reality in normal in the uh, ace map options anyway let's get to our orientation point and draw a straight line to your gun well that should do it that should do it and now I bring my plotter onto the gun and rotate it onto my target. You see, uh, it's also on this. Uh, I borrowed it from Tushino. They also have this uh, distance scale. Anyway, uh, to work out your solution, I also added a little what is it? A cheat sheet <laughs> of uh, what to use. What you need is delta distance is distance between the gun and between your target. You see that is uh, 3,000, it's 100, 3,075, uh, 3,080 meter. Let's make it 3,075. So the distance is, let's make it a dot, 3,075 3, meters. The delta elevation, we have uh, the elevation difference between our gun. We have this, uh, well, uh, five meter sign, let's say we are three meters high and how high is our target well that is the 25 line you see they are just below the 25 so they are 24 meters high let's say let's let's see 24 or 25 meters high and the difference between 3 and 25 it's uh, plus 22 so uh, the elevation difference is uh, plus 20 22 meters 
the target azimuth well here comes the feature you need to master because uh, uh, these uh, the most outer scale is the absolute azimuth and you see that that it's four uh, one and this is a no news scale it helps you to determine the uh, fraction of uh, between the two uh, units like uh, 410 and let's 420 and in between you can determine uh, the smaller digits by by checking which one aligns which of these line aligns perfectly with any of these lines between uh, the red lines and the blue lines you see the eight aligns perfectly with here so you don't have to mind this number you have to mind the eight that is the eight so the digit is eight so that is 41 e8 it's 418 degrees the target azimuth is 418 degrees 400 18 degrees sight azimuth that's what you draw this line they drew this line to your orientation point because in this scale the inner blue scale that is actually your sight azimuth scale you see that start with 3000 yet on the north but the, be the barrel points and it's numbered counterclockwise so it increases counterclockwise to the south point 6000 so here you can read your sight azimuth which would be and, and you also we have to aware that it's numbered counterclockwise so it's 48 that's what it starts 48 and it's 83 48 48 84 48 84 so your sight doesn't would be 48 84 good now what you need is your range card range table let's bring up the range table no matter how hard it is yeah so that is uh, the, the range is three three thousand seventy five that would be i guess three charge three because charge four will not get to go that far low angle we shoot low angle we could want to get fast the target thirty twenty five so uh 3050 is the closest is the base elevation it's 305 you here need three numbers you need the number between uh, the next 50 3100 you need to elevate five mils so that is the uh, uh, the elevation difference for 50 meter target uh, distance difference and you also need the this number 35 which is the elevation difference for 100 meters elevation difference between the target and the gun so what you need is the base elevation 305 the the difference between the next elevation that's 5 and 35 so 305 5 35 the base elevation is 305 now as the site azimuth the base elevation is 305 50 meter difference is 5 mils and the 100 meter elevation I don't remember 100 meter ele elevation difference was charge 3 3050 it was 35 so you need to elevate 35 mils if you want to go 100 meters higher anyway you now you need all the you, you have all the data you you might need and you need to correct now the base elevation for the distance you see the distance was 3050 and we had to add 25 mils and here comes this tool this is basically a slide rule uh, a very basic slide rule and uh, the slide rule is to calculate it's to divide and uh, multiply anyway what we need to do is is we know that we have 20 50 meters difference you you, you find the 50 here on the outer scale 55 mils of uh, Oh wait, yeah, I just moved my tool. I did not want to. Uh, the 50 meter you pair with fif with five mils. You see the 50 meters I paired with five mils, and now I come back like here, and the 25 meters 2.5 mils, so two and a half mils. The distance distance correction for the base elevation is plus two and a half mils. 
because we are shooting low angle if we shoot high angle we have to depress anyway that's a different story but you also need uh, for the uh, elevation difference we need to correct the elevation difference is 22 meters plus well uh, every 100 meter elevation every 35 meters give us 100 meter elevation difference so with the 100 meters we pair with the 35 you see here that is the 100 meters that is the 35 and we start to go to 22 meters and it's 21 22 that's 7.56 7.7 mils plus the elevation correction is 7.7 .7 mils plus wonderful so now we have our solution 7.7 .7 plus 2.5 that's 9 that's 9 10.2 so it's rounded it's 10 so the base elevation you have to add 10 315 is our solution 315 good so we have now the site as in with 4884 and 315 the elevation and charge 3 let's set up our gun get into it bring up the site what was the solution is 315 mils so we page up and page down we get to 315 mils now I depress the site and now I elevate the gun elevate the gun until the bubble until the bubble starts to move, you see started to move, yeah, go back now I'm fine, I elevated the gun to the uh, desired 315 mils elevation now I need to rotate it to what side? Site azimuth is 4884 so now I rotate the site to 4884 and that was the house you see on the map my orientation point was the southern edge of that house which house? this house you see this house but anyway I need to go to uh, 4884 45, 46, 48, 84 4884 and now I rotate the entire gun 48 to 4884 until I start to see the house my orientation point what is it? I have to rotate clockwise it's the house, it's the southern edge you see because on the map I have this house as an orientation point and now I'm seeing that at the southern edge of that house in my site so my site is fine my elevation is fine I get out uh, take a, take a shell Load the shell Take a casing, charge 3 that was, I set charge 3, load casing, get into the gun again, and check if everything is fine, that's fine, 4884. 315, 4884, 315, fire. Go to our spotter, binoculars. How oh, they start shooting? Ah, Magyar Magamna. Bong, hit. Wonderful. I hope you enjoyed.